preview. I'm Andy Abaya. And I'm Kobe Brown. And today we have a very special video. Ano yun, yes. Andy? Ano yun, Andy? So these are the 10 things you did not know about Kobe and Andy. According to Kobe and Andy. But I know a lot about you. Oh, sila, they don't know kasi. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Mo naman sila. Oh, sige, sige. Ka, no. <laughs> okay, let's go. So my first fact is I have to bring a toothbrush or toothpaste wherever I go now. Lalo na my pandemic, we're always wearing masks. Whenever I, I'm always like eating out or you know, maybe I'll get a coffee and I don't like smelling my breath. So I want it to smell good. So kanina. I mean, now I brought my toothbrush and toothpaste with me. That's what I did. <laughs> wow, tularan si Kobe. Lagi magto toothbrush. Ikaw, do you bring any, I know, even like mint? Diba ikaw, fuck mo lang? Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> One fact you probably did not know about me is that kulang yung I lack one tooth in my bottom teeth. Where? Supposedly, dapat apat siya here, but I only have three. See? One, two, three. I never noticed that, you know. Another fact about me is I hated doing VTRs when I was younger. My mom would always bring me to mga commercials for like casting and stuff. But I mean hindi ko, hindi ko gusto. Nahi sobrang nahiya ako at I would always cry when I had to go. My mom would have to like say to me, "Oh, let's let's if you go, we're gonna eat somewhere after." I so, <laughs> yeah, that, my that's, that's like my reward. <laughs> my next one is, I used to be dyslexic when I was younger. It's it's one of the things that I just found out recently. Because I didn't know my parents ko na, oh, we have to do this for preview. Like any ten things people don't know about me. And yun, that was one of the things that they shared to me before I even entered school was pabaliktad and it was perfect. Wow. Perfect na baliktad. Tapos I also had a hard time speaking. That's, so yung pronunciation. That's ko. probably why you say I know you love to itao. Yeah. So whenever my lolo would say na I love you to me, he would say love love to itao. Because when I was younger, that's how I used to pronounce it. Love ko ikaw, and I say love to <laughs> love to itao. And because of that, parang what my parents did was they enrolled me to an additional year in preschool. So I had pre nursery, then nursery, then kinder, then prep. Wow. <laughs> yeah. I, love wow. to itao. I'm so surprised by your thoughts already. Like, I guess. Gulat na gulat ka nga eh. <gasps> There's a lot of stuff you're hiding. Oh, di ba? Kasi 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 I know you. Oh. <laughs> the third thing you probably didn't know about me is I started traveling by the age of seven by myself. Wala akong kasama. Nag-iisa ako. Parang hanggang na yun, nag-iisa ako. I'm joking. May kasama na ako. Because I used to live in the UK, so we'd always go to like the Philippines, Sampo different nga countries. Um, while making, while you making uh, to So I used to travel. So I used to travel a lot. There would be times where I'd have to like go alone, or just me and my brother. Really? Bro yeah, just me and my oh, brother. Amazing. So that's why whenever I go to the airport, hindi ko kailang on my kasama, kasi Ooh. I can do it by myself. So ball? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So, so I mean, if you need help going to the airport, I mean, if you can just bring me on your trip. Nako, hindi ako papayagan ng mami ko. Tita Liz, uh, Tita John, back in a man. Another fact you probably didn't know about me is that I'm ambidextrous. I'm comfortable with using both my left and right hand for in different activities like writing, drawing, painting, doing my makeup. Whenever I do my makeup, parang let's say eyeliner, di ba? Kasi sometimes it would get in the way of me. Yeah. So I would like switch hand, and it, I would be comfortable with it. Um, by the age of ten, I lived in three continents. I had my own business. I had, you know. <laughs> 
<laughs> Just, no, I lived in three continents by the age of 10. I lived in Europe, Asia, and America. America as well. We would always move around a lot. And I'm so happy that I had, I got the experience to live in these other countries, discover these other cultures, especially in the, I mean, every now and then. I, I wouldn't say I was living there, but I would go there a lot. Sa Qatar, sa Middle East. So yeah, I'm very um, culturally you know, exposed. Yeah. Come on. Okay, next fact about me is back when the pandemic started, 2020, the start of pandemic, my family, we started an, uh, an online food business. Tapos, I was the little chef. Is that, so, the, is that the name, the little chef? Or and that, you're the, the lure. Lure. I'm the little chef. I started like testing some flavors for our chicken, for our chicken wing, macaroni, like big macaroni. Tapos, wow. we followed my recipe. So, well, how come you've never cooked for me? Um. At bakit mas ano mas masarap yung fried rice ko? Excuse me. What? Actually, sa bahay ni kuya special ngay mga hot dog na niluluto ko. May pangalan <laughs> yun. And my last fact is I'm kind of only looking out of one eye right now. Yung eye nito, it's. Grade is 400. Since I was younger, I've had a lazy eye and I only found out a few years ago. So now I can't fix it. I mean, if I wear, I wear glasses na man. Pero, siguro, ano, didn't you tell me once I should get, I know, try and get laser eye surgery. Lasik. Yeah, but this eye is really messed up. And so how do I get to fix it? Because when I do this, I can hardly see you guys. It's like super blurry. 400 talaga yung grade. Sana mag graduate na siya soon. <laughs> Char. Okay, my last fact is I love spicy food. Whenever I eat, I eat with chili flakes or chili oil. Wait, I never saw that before. My mom makes this delicious adobo. So yung sauce niya, I would get the sauce. Diba yun yung may toyo, may yeah. suka na oil. Nina sauce. So I put it in a saucer and then I would put the chili oil there. You put it in the <laughs> chili oil like, secretly? No, no, no. no. Oh. I, separate, I separate it and then I put chili oil. Tapos, I put it sauce for the adobo. Sauce is yeah. not adobo, but I put it extra sauce for the adobo so that it can be spicy. Ah, okay. So that's one example of what I do. Never ako na try ng spicy adobo. Try mo. Sige. Parang masarap. Have you heard of the Japanese mayo? Ang ginawa ko, I get like the Japanese mayo, then I mix it with the sriracha sauce. Grab and set up. It's like spicy mayo. Mm. Sriracha mayo. For this portion of the video, I'm gonna say Andy's fact for her. This is an extra bonus fact for Andy. Yeah. And Andy will say one about me as well. Yeah, and this is something you probably didn't know as well. Yeah. So, it's the ultimate reveal. So, I, I was thinking a while about this, and you know, I noticed, and I don't know if you noticed as well, but Andy is a perfectionist. Hindi lang sa trabaho, pero sa, I mean, like, whenever I go over to her house, like, if something is moved, she wants it to be back in place. She'd get like mad, Hoy, put that back! I don't get mad. Not mad, not mad, but like, you just like things in place. Yeah. Oh, you really like things in place, so. Natakot ako. <laughs> because I don't want to move anything that, and I don't want to move anything or ruin um, the placement of it. You can, man. You just have to put it back ah, in place. Yeah, so <laughs> yeah but you, you are a perfectionist. I love it when everything's organized. And now, what is this? Are you ready? No, I'm not. Okay. Oh yeah. So, this is a bonus fact about Kobe that you guys probably didn't know. So, Kobe, I've noticed this ever since na nasa loob pa lang kami ng bahay. Kobe has this habit of, you know, pretending to chew, but like chewing on a, uh, a fake gum whenever oh. he's nervous. Oh, totoo yun. Example? I don't, I, don't, I don't know why, but it's always been a habit of mine to just like, just pretend I'm like chewing. I'm not sure. I remember my mom would get really mad at me for doing it. Like, especially when I'd be in front of a camera before. 
naalala ko, like, I think someone told me, like, oh, Kobe, what are you chewing? Mm. I was like, wala po. And I was like, fake chewing because I, I felt so nervous. Was so, this for an addition? I feel like this was in saying goodbye. Oh. So saying goodbye. Okay. Make sure to watch that, by the way. Yeah, you yeah. can watch it. You guys can watch Aichi. that. Aichi. <laughs> I guess I don't do it that much anymore. I think I've become aware. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys got to find out a lot about us because yeah. I definitely found out even more about you today. Of course, you can know more about mm -hmm. us by following us in our social media accounts. And of course, guys, we are inviting I'm you yes. to watch the Connected movie. It's coming out this July 22. We are very excited. This movie is directed by Derek Ted Bobarol, starring PBB Season 9 housemates. Andy Abaya, me, Kobe Brown, Richard Juan, Chico Alikaya, Gail Banawis, Ralph Malibunas, and Amanda Zamora. Oh, and I forgot to mention this is the first movie yes. under Star Magic Studios. So very, very exciting stuff. And you can get your tickets now on ktx.ph. And, and, meron pa. Oh, make sure. Wait lang. Make sure you subscribe to Preview's YouTube channel. Click the subscribe click, button. Click the subscribe button, guys. And hit the bell notifications. Hit the like button. Do all that good stuff. Thank you, guys. Thank you, guys. See you.